Hello, this is uh, Egg Beast, and today we're going to look at making a geometry lod for our weapon. So, here we're looking at a Mark II Sten. I'll just show you what it looks like in game. Okay, this is it in Bulldozer. Okay, now you can see it's quite a complex model. It's got springs on it, it's got catches on it, it's got a sideways mag, it's got holes in the in the buttstock okay well we don't need any of that so let me just alt tab out of there close bulldozer okay back into the model right so basically we look in the geometry lod and you can see we've just got a placeholder geometry here so we've got a muzzle um, proxy which I'm going to hide because we don't need to look at that that's basically for the suppressor so if the suppressor has geometry it will be carried into the geometry lot of the of the weapon when you add the suppressor on and extend the, the the length of the weapon in terms of what it bumps into in game that's what geometry is for so you can see we've got a very rough geometry lot it's just a single box so I'm going to dispose of that we don't need it um, now if I was to take from here and start trying to make a geometry it's way too complicated look how many points there are in it it would just take me all day so what I'm going to do is I've got a pre-made shadow lod nice and simple I'm going to copy that I'm going to copy it into my geometry lod pasted okay and uh, right so we've got all these separate parts yes Yep, they are all separate, that's good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move in the Y direction, 0.2. Oops, there we go. And then I'm going to say faces uh, remove. That's the D key. That gives us four points. Well, it's actually eight points because it's, well, I don't know. Yeah, it's a box, so it's probably eight points. And then I'm going to go structure, convexity, convex hull. Now why did I do that? Well let's look at this one structure, convexity, fine non-convexities. Look, you, can, you can't really see but there's some red dots on some of this stuff. It's showing up as hey I'm non-convex I won't work as geometry. has to be convex to work as geometry. So let's move the next one so we can work on it. We're going to go faces, remove, structure, convexity, convex hull. Then we're going to take the next piece and we're going to move it and then press D okay and then keeping the point selected structure convexity convex hull take the magazine view top just check oh, that's a two piece right okay so view front we, we don't want to do them both in the same piece of geometry because one's a piece of the superstructure of the gun and the other piece is the animated magazine so move and then structure uh, convexity oh no sorry I've missed it faces remove structure convexity convex hull there we go so we rinse and repeat for all of this lot so I'll just go D Structure, convexity, convex hull. Just move it. Next piece. Move. Faces, remove. Structure, convexity, convex hull. It's kind of a rinse and repeat scenario here. So D, structure, convexity, convex hull little bit more difficult to make that you see because of the shape and everything so there we go that's that bit now this bit is going to be probably a bit of a mess so what I would do here is use the point selector to grab those points copy and paste right move structure no faces remove structure convex hull okay and then I would delete those points and then I would use the point selector again to take this and this control C V move okay and then delete that point we don't want that 
grab that whole piece, press D, and then structure, convex D, convex hull. Now, this time, see so we've got that, we want to take this, delete. We then just got the last piece. Select that piece, D, structure, convex D, convex hull, move. Right, we've now got our whole sten as a convex entity, so we're going to move that back down as a whole. That's now in place. Let's have our proxy put back in. Now, on this side, I'm going to remove these two. So I'm leaving hide, well, hide suppressor. Ah, this is, this is an animated selection, okay. Which is this piece. Let's have a look at where it is. So, do we have a hide suppressor on here? I don't think we do. No, I was, ah, it's something I was experimenting with before. Okay, so we don't need that. Magazine, we do need, right, view, top. So there's the magazine. Now notice because we removed the faces, the dots remained and they have now got the property, uh, the selection magazine. But we want the whole thing to be magazine. So we need to redefine that as magazine. So that now highlights the whole magazine. View front. Now the last thing we want to do is we've cleaned up the left hand side selections. We now need to go structure, topology, uh, find components. And that now populates our component list, which when you've got a properly sequential populated list of components, means it will actually work in the geometry. That's our geometry lot done. Uh, last thing we want to do is add some mass to it. So let's just give it a mass of 100. Apply. That's now got mass. And that's how to do geometry lot. Cheers.